An attempted ATM heist caught on camera. Police set up an early Monday morning at Union Station in downtown Jackson. Four men in a tan pickup slammed through the glass doors and went straight for the cash machine. You can see them in this surveillance video trying to get the ATM, but when they couldn't, they took off. Police found that truck less than a mile away, but no suspects. Just a few hours earlier and four miles away, this sit-go convenience store Megger Evers was broken into. They broke into gold. The manager, Gary Singh, says the crooks busted through a hole in the back of the store, took thousands of dollars worth of beer, cigarettes, and cigars, $300 from the cash register, and raided the ATM. But this time, he says, they did not take the machine with them. They just opened and emptied it. But they have mastermind. Nobody opened the East ATM ED. I don't know how they open the ATM ED over there. Almost every day, you know, you got people breaking in the stores, taking the ATM. Benjamin Johnson does a lot of repair work for stores that get broken into. He's seen a major increase in ATM heists, but tells us the biggest problem, how much the damage costs the businesses. Most of ATM only had $3,000 in it. And most of the most that I've heard is $5,000. They do, they do $5,000 worth of damage. So therefore, you know, it's bad. It's bad for the store owners. Singh says now he knows of stores who empty their cash machines every night, and some who've gotten rid of their ATMs altogether, fearing for their own safety. We're scared too sometimes. A lot of us. I don't want to nobody wasting no life.